analysis of this developing situation over there from Yuval Tal. Yuval, thank you for being here. Used to be an Israeli soldier, special ops, et cetera. You know this uh, inside and out, a, a mission like this. This Apache helicopter goes down. Six soldiers on board say it crashed. There's six injured now. Will other Israeli soldiers go in there and try to rescue them? If the helicopter is inside Lebanon, for sure, there will be forces coming in and trying to rescue him. Apparently, the chopper went down uh, within the past hour. Uh, it's on the Israeli side, but you've got the worry of having Hezbollah trying to squeeze off some of those rockets at any sort of air force that would come in. Would they come in on land then? Um, Hezbollah would probably try to uh, do as much damage as they can. Uh, the, the air force and the Israeli army is very well trained to make sure that no uh, pilot is, is being captured, and if, they, if there's a chance for that, they will do a yeah. lot to make sure uh, he's back. Mm -hmm. What do you think about these prisoner exchanges that have occurred in the past and, of course, are now leading the demands, as uh, Syria said, you know what, we're interested in, in talking? It, it's, it's, right now it's a bigger issue. If that was just three soldiers being kidnapped and there was a chance to uh, take them out militarily, they probably would have done it by now. Um, the chances on that is that it's going to get into a um, Black Hawk Down yeah, kind sure. of situation is very likely to get there. So you always weigh the odds of how many other people you're going to risk by trying to rescue the, the, the street soldiers. Is there a rescue oper operation in the planning right now to get these soldiers, maybe two off, uh, two off by themselves, one uh, being held someplace else? Do you have any idea if they're in Lebanon, Iran, Syria? I would assume that there was a plan in the first few days. Uh, probably the situation right now is way out of hand. So it's you wait. It's, it's, it's pro yes. Mm -hmm. um, and Yuval, just when you look at these pictures uh, of what's going on currently, uh, live right now on the Israeli-Lebanese border, what do you think? Um, I think that it's, it's a war that they cannot lose. The Israelis have to win this war. Uh, it's a much, much bigger issue. I think that it's something that the Israelis knew for many, many years. Mm -hmm. And I think now the world is understanding better what's going on. And by the way, that picture right there is of the Apache helicopter that has gone down on the Israeli side just about one hour ago. All right. Yuval Tal, we thank you very much for joining us live today. Thank you, Steve. Coming up, the fighting between Israel troops.